Hello you people and welcome again to another vlog of mine and um yeah pardon me sorry about that yes yeah, change of scenery different room my husband's in bed um over there mum and dad are out and I imagine we'll be left at home responsibly but either it's not looking popular enough to have parties but I, I've got a few friends but they're all over which we be the big seal vlog um it was the the really trophy I can't remember the date now um on the second of this month February um I got a lovely girlfriend um wait well it's not that far uh yeah uh got a girlfriend yeah so that's yes <laughs> I know and this one's only lasted longer than wait no it's not there wait Hang on. Wait. Um. Oh, yes. Say, right, um. So, last time I, um, did a thing and had a girlfriend I was with Molly Sharp who's then on the 11th of January we split up and mutual thing and then a few days later she was Tony Thomas no problem with that and then um, at some point stuff went down and one of Tony's sisters Emma Burford long story the same names but she you'll know what I'm saying I don't know those two have been doing that, I don't even know who they are, actually, he's some bad stuff, blah, 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 then, um, started working with me, and I was, I was single, and at the time, I was pulling like a freight, I was pulling like a freight train, she didn't be the fourth one working with me, not my fault, I mean, I tired, not like I said, hey, you want to work with me, he's like, no, I was just there, just do what I do, got called a pimp <laughs> I'm not a proper pimp it's just they were flirting with me and yes I flirted back with all four and um yeah Emma kind of like well kind of she kind of admitted to me that she fancied me and I admitted to her that I kind of we were we both basically admitted to each other that we with each other, which was kind of just the, the, um, the formality was at this point, we were kind of already at that point where we were near enough going out but not going out because none of us had asked, that changed on the second of this month when I asked her and she said yes, and she went and had a tea, <laughs> oh, she, she already, she, it's um, the 18th, so today is the 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th, 6th, 7th, 8th, 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th. Yes, today is the 17th day. Uh, I've not actually spoken to her yet today because um, stuff's happened. She's been busy. She's met one of us today. Another long story. Sorry about that. I'm sticking out. And basically, um, we met up on the 2nd of February in town. I had my hat on, three really glasses I bought, I've still got blisters from the day. And it was meant to be kind of a bit of a double date with me, her, her best friend and best friend's boyfriend, but they lost the boyfriend. So that he cancelled at the last minute. <laughs> so yeah, it was, it was a good day and this time this relationship is a lot better than with Molly, no offence. Molly. This one is casual, okay? With me and Molly like um, there's more 
this camp's more awkward. I wasn't able to hold a hand or anything. But this, I met with them at the bus stop, at the bus station, Lincoln, and I sent a text saying I'm here. So they they're already there at Martin's, which is a new agent's type place. So I go there, Emma, hug, hug back, holding hands, and boom! Great five hours. And we're meeting up tomorrow, the 19th of February. And um, Tony and Molly are going to be there. So let's get the situation straight, okay? Molly and Tony are going out. Uh, and we're up there. So basically, I'm doing out with my ex's boyfriend. No. Well, no. Why did I say that? That's, that's horribly wrong. I'm going out with my ex's boyfriend's sister. That's what, if I'm going out with my ex's boyfriend, I'm going out with him, which is... I don't go that, I don't go that way, that's not how I roll. So weird. I don't go to Pimp a few weeks back, when I had four on four. I was going to tell be using the like, roll, more often, with my style and stuff. Um, excitement and happiness and stuff like that. I, you know, using buzzing. And um, if things are busy, say uh, something's hopping. But that, well, that's just, I don't know where that came from. And um, basically, yes, yeah, so we're going to meet up tomorrow, all four of us. Me, my girlfriend, her brother, and his girlfriend is my ex. Not at all awkward, it isn't. And we're going to go down to a place called the Carson Centre. And see if they've got any job vacancies available. Molly's just tagging along. And um, then afterwards we might go get a pizza. Not one each. Me and Emma might share. There's a good pizza place down my street, or I think it's called Pizza Parlor or something like that. And the guy there, I think he's Italian. I've only been there twice, but I think he treats me good because I am a friend. I went down there for a meet the others, which is basically their equivalent of the Domino's and Meteor. It's a good pizza, both of them. And he said, I do you an extra good pizza. Extra cheese, extra bacon. I treat you nice like a friend. I'm like, thanks. This is really charging me normal, but I'm getting extra good. I take him down there. Yeah, meaty pizza. And then Friday is Friday, which would be the. whatever Friday it is. <laughs> the 21st, I think. We will all meet up in Horn Castle and go swimming. Which is really good. Because. <laughs> it is, it's good, it's good. Tim says it might look faster than Earthworm Custom, but I don't know. I don't know. I'm... I don't care. Not in a horrible way. Just. Emma. Yeah. She doesn't actually have a swimming costume because she doesn't like swimming, she says she can't swim, she drowns. But she wanted to do this, so she didn't have to do it with her. She wants to do this, so it's not my fault, or my thing anyway. And she went on Monday, because she didn't have a swimming costume, and bought a swimming costume, I think. She bought some for swimwear, but she went to me because we were talking about it, and she said she'd rather even get a tankini, which you're a guy, like me, and you have no idea what that is, and you're thinking about destroying stuff and nuclear missiles and fire and stuff at the time, then it's not what you think it is, or it's not what I thought it was. Because at first I thought it was like some kind of some costume thing, like military camouflage. I don't ask why. I was thinking about fire and destroying stuff, and bacon, and Emma. I think about Emma a lot. But yes.
the tank's gonna be like a bikini, but it covers his stomach. You guys didn't get one of those or a swing costume. You haven't got one of those, you actually, it's like basically a price, it's right now. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna be, I'm just gonna be smooth. I mean, this is just, with me and I'm just kind of, boom. With me and Molly, I was as smooth as extra cream to peanut butter. Yes, the pattern was nice. And, I really laughed a bit. I was really bad at makeup thing which she still hasn't put on YouTube, but that doesn't really matter. With Emma, it's like I'm a, I'm a smooth as Michael Jackson on Early Land Farms, smooth criminal. I mean Early Land Farm to cover version. I'm basically Michael Jackson smooth criminal after a smooth shave. How much smooth if you want? Don't actually answer that. I actually do answer that. I don't get very many comments. Answer that question. How much smoother do you want me to get? Obviously I've not had a shave. It's bad to save memory space. I've done from high quality to low quality. But I have massive of chin hair. That's not actually chin hair. That's just that hair there. Or oh, I have a lot of hair. Headroom balaclava. But yeah. I'm not, you know, me and Mert up basically Wednesday, which is what this video is mostly about. I guess there's a whole lot on hand, and um, basically we didn't know what we were doing. So we just kind of ended up walking around town, we walked up Steep Hill, which is so called name because it's a steep hill. And we walked down and we walked around, walked through a few shops. I got messy from one of the four lasses that I had been working with, her name's Sam. And um, she wasn't very happy with me. The last time I spoke to her before um, that Saturday was when she said that she effing hates me. Yeah. And um, that Saturday, she sent me a message on Facebook calling me, well, it said you son of a, and then, well, bitch. Yeah, she called me a son of a bitch. I don't like saying in my videos, but I'm quoting. That's what she said. I spoke to her again today and found out what she's saying. She, I don't think she really hates me anymore. She didn't want to hate me in the first place. But yeah, me, uh, me and Emma just kind of discussed. And there's a bench in Lincoln Town near the market and there's like this red telephone box nearby but rather than being at a phone booth it says cash but no it doesn't give free cash at the physical cash machine in the phone booth there's kind of a bench near it and we were sat on there so if this is the bench you got Tasha her friend well her name, we got, her name is actually uh, Natasha I cannot remember so I had to make a note of it. Uh sorry about this Natasha Natasha Bradley. Sorry Natasha, but I doubt she should re watch this video. So yes, it is bench. And yeah, I'd Natasha this end of the bench. And she was as far away from me and Emma as possible. So Emma was in the middle, now in this side. The Natasha, Emma, me. I was very naturally, I thought to myself, wouldn't it be nice if I put my arm around her? But I didn't finish the thought. By the time I got to nice, my arm had gone round her. What did she do? She'd come with the same place. And me and Freddy at the time were there, she had smuggling. There was nothing dirty, I don't do that on an eight, the first date, and be in public and see it and then don't make a YouTube video about it. That's not how I roll. <laughs> oh, the hands, the hands, they do the talking. Boom. So yeah, I'm in a good mood. 
and um, because I had 3D glasses, I got told that I look like Skrillex, who's some DJ. Don't subscribe to him, subscribe to me. Please. And after a few years later, hey, why bother with Skrillex and Squirrel X? Because it's just a mixtape thing. Now I can't even DJ. And the Squirrel X thing is that. Yeah, but anyway. See you in tomorrow, and I am buzzing my nuts off. Not literally. That would be messy. <laughs> I am actually not excited. I like I like cinema. Oh, speaking of buzzing. Oh, some guy invited me to play some thing on Facebook. No. Some people have no life. Like me. I just talk to myself and post it on Facebook. Well, not Facebook, YouTube. I'm not bad enough to post it on Facebook. Yet. But yes, Emma. So beautiful. I'll actually send um, a link to this video. So, um, around this time, Miss uh, Emma. Love you lots, Princess. Yeah. It's true, I do. And yeah, I call her princess, and one day I hope to make her my queen, but that's what, seven, eight, ten years? Depends on stuff. But she, she's a brilliant lass. Five foot one, she's going to my chin and I'm standing up, but that's no problem. I find it adorable, I do. If anyone has a problem with that, then they can take it up with me and I can put them down. And something has stopped. Why does Google plus stop during videos? Like, due to past experience, this video will probably cut off soon. But yes, well, I am Emma. Thanks for my chin. No problem with that, I find it adorable. If anyone has a problem with that, I can, they can take it up with me and I can put them down. In a cynical, politically incorrect, and unintentionally slightly racist social way. But you know, I'm not going to put up with people giving a hassle. Yes, he has anxiety. So what? Your nose is too big. And some angry you can watch me die somehow. <laughs> oh, some. No, someone's vibrating me again on Facebook. Stop vibrating me. But no, I'm not saying your nose is big. And because no one watches this, and it's just me talking to myself, I'm basically saying I've got a big nose. Thank you. I do this stuff these days. Really, really like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> like, talking this one, one person talking this way, another. And you don't want to cross over the eye. No, you don't. Anyway. Emma, one of the tangents, sorry there Emma, um, beautiful lass, absolutely adore her, I miss her so much, yeah, so, long story short, I'm Squirrel X and I will be dripping the not uh, I'm Squirrel X and I will be dropping down Notice Beats since whenever it is I learned to DJ. And I've got a beautiful girl and Bertha. Let's move over to bits and nothing will change that. We all know how much I like bacon, my brother knows me. We all know how much I like bacon. I made a list, but I've made a, making a book, but well, I was. Of 1001 reasons why bacon is better than love. And okay, I've only got 84 reasons. But if I had to choose either Emma or bacon, and the other one would be destroyed from existence completely, my only question would be what is bacon? 
If it wouldn't be intuitive bacon, you would just cease to exist. You would never have existed. It would always be Emma. Emma or bacon. Bacon goes over there, Emma comes to me. If only it was that simple, she lives near Horncastle, which is about six and a half hour walk away. Man, do it. In a pair of Sarah's hate budgie smugglers while tornado while some tornadoes giving psycho outside. I would. Middle of the night. Storm. Mental storm going on. And I do it in a pair of handmade Sarah's hate budgie smugglers. I would. True story. Basically, uh, well, if you're watching this, and I've just uh, watched it from the 16 minute mark onwards. You're still watching this, Emma. Uh, this is me, Nelson, to the however many people have watched this. I love you. Always will do, and I'll never leave you. Uh, yeah, I can leave you if I die, and I'm not gonna die. I refuse to die. Fix so shouldn't be coming down the track like <laughs> asshole. Just walk off the track. And if I can't walk off, I just turn around, give a fake train, and punch in the face. Like, what are you virtually bang? I just think I'd go to the game. Ooh. Sorry, I'm gonna have to go. That was Tony telling me Emma's on Facebook and about well, that this tablet I'm using is the only source of internet I've got. Goodbye people. Love you Emma. See you on Facebook.